Hello guys, uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of the day is right to you. Uh, good good day to you YouTube as well. Uh, welcome, welcome guys. Austerus here. Uh, potential last day playing uh, classified friends if everything will be fine with our internet here. We have air alarm after air alarm after air alarm today. Uh, whole night air alarms, uh, whole day today so far air alarms. Uh, the one, the mom one moment, like one ended, like half an hour. Next one starting. Uh, so there's there's uh, some shit going on here. Anyway, yesterday, yesterday, uh, I was a little befouled by uh, by what happened with our day counter uh, on the mission to uh, day counter to D day. Uh, but I was a little bit sleepy to uh, fully realize what actually happened. I was rewatching the video today, and uh, let, let, let me just put this video up. Let me put the video. So I'm gonna, gonna grab the camera over here, I'm gonna put uh, the camera over here for now. And uh, the video we had, the video we had, uh, the replay from, from a previous day. Uh, let, let, me, let me jump to it. Let me jump to it. So previous day replay. That was this one, and yes, yeah, so look, we went to the mission. Uh, we went to the mission here. On the, on this mission, which is actually did, did replay it, uh, because first time like we we, we got. Oh my god! Okay, uh, that's that's we starting the mission. So this is we pre pre preparing for a mission, guys. We're preparing for a mission here. Uh, give, give, give me, give me the the day count. The day count. So this is this, this is the mission itself. All right. Uh, so day count seven days. Uh, a day count here is uh, is uh, seven uh, seven days. All right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, seven days over here. Seven days over here. Mission, uh, mission itself, mission briefing. Oh my god, I press the wrong button again. Mission briefing itself. Uh, mission briefing, mission briefing. Show me mission briefing. All right, let's just click on it. Click on it. Uh, all right, so completing this mission will result in all enemy units being incapacitated. This mission will result in enemy destroying one region strength. So days to mission completion over here, you see two, uh, two days. So seven minus two should be five days. Five days uh, remain for until the due day. Potentially uh, two, two more missions for me to do before the day to get to fill this uh, uh, this sink over here as this gauge. So we went on a mission with a two days uh, time uh, with us uh, incapacitating all all enemy units, which is they didn't done. And we came from uh, after the mission. Uh, we came after the mission, and day to day, day uh, became two. Somehow, how how it is like anyone, any developers watching this? Can you explain how this how this two days happen? How like we went on a mission for uh, for two days. We had seven, and the mission lasted actually five days, and I'm running out of days for a D-Day, and I didn't feel the, the, the gauge over here. So, like, what happened over here? Like, what, 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 what really happened over here? That, that's a question. Uh, I, I want to uh, have answer for that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, let's get to back uh, to, to a normal camera, and we're going to be continue with... Actual. So hello, sorry for buzzing me. I want to offer a promotion for a channel. Yeah, sorry, but you're not sorry, are you? Um, hold it, hold it. Where's me? Where's me banning sync? Where, where is it? Okay, it's actually uh, moderated. Uh, where, where is the bounce? 
Okay, uh, block. Blocked. That was the, 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 the shit. Uh, okay, air alarm is over here. Yeah, I, I really don't have the game sound right now because I'm topped out of here. Uh, okay, there is a bomb, there is a bomb. Here we go, here we go. Anyway, uh, so back uh, back to the two days, so I guess like one mission and we did day zero. Uh, but a, a little bit disappointed about that. Missing like, you know, those the big spawn of potentially two more missions and we are low on low on stuff as well anyway it's saying it's saying it will incapacitate enemy uh, enemies it say that after that mission that we should incapacitate all enemies but look at them they're just doing reprisal here like nothing happened so I, I suspect there was some some game bug. I suspect there was some some game bug. That that's what happened to us. Uh, so task uh, objectives. Uh, we have some guys who are uh, really tired over here. Some guys really tired, so we let, let them rest. Uh, Cassidy King. Uh, I guess we're sending my scout guy. Johnson and a sniper guy. Any one of those gonna go on a mission. So we have uh, this is a brutal ambush. We absolutely need to get uh, board the ship and detect it, eliminate the uh, marine officer, uh, sing the uh, MNL. That's the objective for this mission. So we're taking a scout guy. Uh, we need to repair the region. So repair the region. This is a radicals. If you look looking uh looking at the factions here. Radicals and criminals almost get to the next level there. Alright. So uh we want want to repair the region with uh the sniper guy repair this region okay we want to uh, aid faction aid criminal faction here and uh, we're gonna send uh, I, some, uh, I, I, say, I said her I said her deployed uh, criminal criminals All right that's uh, that done for a mission briefing or debriefing. Uh, we did got uh, some loadouts. Do we do we need to talk with anyone? Okay, there's there's talk with Vincent and uh, Alame. It's strange. There are no horses around this countryside. They have all been taken by the Bosch. The thoroughbreds are taken as cavalry remounts. The rest pull army wagons. Jesus, the Frittis just took them? Oh, they paid, but only a fraction of the price. That explains why the farmers have been so helpful around here. Some of them, but do not trust too easily. There are Vichists and collaborators everywhere. A few farmers are getting fat on selling to the Germans. All right, uh, there we go, morale. Morale back, so Alami can go on a mission. Should have sent, should have talked and then sent him on a mission because she, she would be tired <laughs> next. That's fine. That's fine, right? Uh, anyway, anyway. We are taking like uh, one, one of those on the next mission. Uh, so, what's it gonna be? Do we have like a level up for uh, any of those? Zero skills, zero skills, zero skills, zero skills, zero, zero skills for Alami. Uh, so we actually want this bullet storm. Mm -hmm. If you break an enemy, uh, if you remain in MP2, you can, uh, you can still shoot. That's what I was missing here. Because uh, uh, of aim and fi uh, fire reduced as well. So let's guess. Uh, let, let's get that. Let's get that for that. For now. 
Right, 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 right. Uh, she had two skill points as the medic, and uh, that was accuracy against vulnerable armor, uh, as already learned. So we have uh, more radius over here. We have skills, more IP for her. And she is uh, getting this exposed. Quick exposure. Wait, did I not? Uh, okay, I, I got I got myself a IP out to kill. Never mind, I was scared that I didn't. Maxim morale, and uh, we can get her doge, make her doji. She's a doji woman. You know, we can find this loose kind of type. Uh, right, right, so uh, about uh, our uh, uh, weapons and stuff. So what do we have for weapons? Anything here? No weapons. No new weapons. And uh, what about the, the gear? Doesn't look any more gear, uh, any new gear we get from the previous mission. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, so what else? What else? What else? So this insurgently uh, insurgency that rises the three enemy units at the same time. It's uh, back on zero out of three when it was two out of three actually for me. I just notice. I just notice about this one. And th this is this is like all all the game bugs, which is uh, from nine out of ten game uh, that I rated this game initially will drop down my uh, well already dropping down my opinion about the game. This stuff should should, should have been tested. So a semi-automatic rifle and uh, light machine gun is to three morale damage. 3 AP. So we, we got we got this one already, do we? Valiant. Anyway, so Castle D King, uh, you, and uh, any one of you. I know it's Alamir or Johnson's better. It's uh, so he he gets he gets the the right uh, machine gun over there. The question is, uh, does his right uh, have the right skills here? So he has a uh, killing zone, he has this, if you break enemy, if you break enemy use the primary weapon, uh, you can uh, stun on all units and spray zone after, one IP cost, uh, healing, and they, they almost have the same build here, except uh, this guy doesn't have like, uh, the heal here. Alright, alright. Okay. So I guess like we're taking a Lame, since we don't need like to give him any new uh, weapon. So Cassidy and King, however, uh, they do want to get a, a better shotguns here. Nine uh, damage over here. It's actually uh, the, the same the same type of a shotgun over here. This one have disrupted. This have uh, doesn't have disrupted. I may as well uh, give it to her. Uh, Cassidy. So eight acres in armor. Uh, we want we want this uh, rifle over here. Okay. So that's about the gear. That's about the gear for those guys. Uh, they're all ready and willing. Let's launch the mission. So bird sh ship and detected and eliminate uh, the marines. Potentially, what what uh, could be our last or. Uh, one of the last missions here. Hi. 
Eyes on the boat. Let's convert it into a submarine. So, uh, submarine. That's that's a good idea. That's a good idea. We can kill uh, two guys over here. Um, well, four guys, and I need, need to eliminate officers. Uh, where are those officers? So those guys are moving anywhere. Doesn't look like they're moving. So this guy is moving over here. This guy is moving over here. So those are the marines. There's a, uh, the charges where we need to uh, places where I need to set, set a charge. Okay, so we can start with eliminating those guys over here. Maybe like eliminated this guy as well. Actually, this guy has uh, been seen. Where's my scout boy? Yes. Okay, okay, it doesn't, doesn't look uh, uh, that's gonna expose me. So I'll stick down, complete it. So this guy is not gonna see me. There's some guy over here. So we uh, want to get to, to that to that area. Doesn't uh, look like this guy can see uh, any scene over here. So as long as we uh, stay in this area, we should be uh, we should be safe. Mm-hmm. You want me? For now. Amy? Should be safe over here. And I think uh, of moving uh, you a little bit closer. So this guy is uh, moving that way. And he's a machine gunner. So that could be problematic. This could be problematic. I mean, I'll just like officers. We have like an officer over here. Doesn't look like. Look, he's moving over here. Maybe you can even put this guy over here. So we can uh, intercept this guy. Yeah. Okay, there's another machine gunner. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Speed up the enemy patrol. So he's uh, moving that way on the board. Those guys just staying there. Not twice or two to what's just gonna happen to them. So uh, then we uh, just eliminating this guy. R wrong guy. Wrong guy. Eliminated him with him. Gonna kill uh, two more guys. One of them will be the sniper. Assassinated. So we don't know how the hell this guy gonna move. Let's say we just put uh, those guys closer over here. Do you know if he's gonna move over here or he's gonna move just uh, back to where he came from? But in any case, uh, from this uh, perspective, we need to move my boys uh, still closer. Take these positions. I want to, for them to, to stay uh, grouped up. You stay there, you're going... Uh, okay, so he's going over there. He, he actually uh, 
I generally want to go like uh, on, on the board of a ship. So it's good for me. Just need to wait until uh, until they they just out of there. Okay, so uh, my scout boy. Go and eliminate this guy. All right, so uh, that, that's like another officer that I need to kill. That's another officer that we need to kill. We need to get on the ship first, and get started killing killing those guys. In the meantime, so we want uh, some some guys over here uh, engaging those boys. And uh, some guys over here engage in those boys as well. Yeah, those guys are easy to, to, to kill. So like if start in my ambush, I want to start ambush with killing that guy, alright? So like, uh, yeah, we got, we're getting those guys on the ship, potentially, and then getting, uh, those guys gonna be, uh, uh turning around, but, uh, we can deal with that. So let's say, let's say I will stay over here. Let's say we stay over here. I mean, we can engage those guys from here, but there's a grenade here. So if you want to engage them, uh, the better way to do it is uh, from somewhere over here. Right, okay, so uh, anyway, want, want, want to, uh, to hold my people in the same... Maybe even I want to get like on the, on board of ship like over here, through this area. So I are going all around here. So I don't know how many soldiers on that on, on that. Yeah, everything will be fine. Okay, it goes over here. Let's put the gun as a machine gunner down. Should be fine. If you're staring around over here, should be fine too. And uh, the guy was machine gun. Moving out over here. Alright, so the machine gunner are gonna move uh, back. This machine gunner, gunner move back. Those guys just staying there. So those guys watching, uh, we do want to start an ambush, like a real ambush turn over here. So let's say like we, we, we put in this guy like somewhere over here, how far I can throw the stone. So I turn the, this guy attention over there. Did I do it? Okay, uh, uh, not okay. Didn't turn him like uh, a right angle over there. Should have like, uh, get a little bit closer and turn him like this angle. Should have. Should have. Um. 
Yeah, I, ca I, ca I can't get through here, can I? Or can I? If I move over here... Okay, move over here, but... It's got me detected because I did, did need, did need to, uh, to turn him around and go there. Hey, sorry, guys. Uh, yeah, yeah. Turn him in a, uh, a little bit. Should have got a little bit closer there. Mm -hmm. It's fine. It's fine. It's the last mission. Therefore, to do some bit, some mistakes, a uh, slight mistakes. The plan, the plan was good. The execution was uh, as always poor. So much of not, not reloading, I know, I know, I know. So much of not reloading. Did a lot fair fair share of the uh, uh, of this today. So we need, need to get a little bit closer here in order to uh, actually distract him in in, the, in this direction there. Oh, but. Uh, is this guy still seeing him? I don't think this, this guy can see him. Maybe that's what, what I'm doing here is uh, is a bullshit. So we're giving him uh, we're giving him a turn. Uh, this is gonna detect it. Okay, it's not gonna detect it. So I can kill this guy and we can start an ambush. Uh, yeah. Uh, then we are setting my cooldown by moving. Uh, but moving, 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 moving. Uh, this guy and detect it on, on a board. So, uh, what do we want? We want to suppress the guy with machine gun. I want to suppress the guy with a machine gun, so like... Uh, oh my god, where's my machine gunner? So let's say like we move in over here. So there's a guy we're gonna be shooting. Oh, can I even get a better position here? Like... Uh, there's an officer from, from this position. Maybe, maybe like uh, getting them over here is, is just better. We can shoot a suppressor officer and shit. So moving him over here. We can like suppress uh, suppress those guys. Then we're moving uh, the guy with uh, a shotgun to shoot those guys in the face. over here it's not exactly a shotgun guy so that's gonna restart my cooldowns here or set the cooldowns and well the shotgunner guy the shotgunner guy uh, I need to go over here I need to kill those guys somehow so 100% on killing that and we're doing a little bit more all damage to this guy, and then we can knife him and do potentially some suppressing damage on, on those guys. Uh, let's look at a plan. So, uh, meanwhile, uh, this guy is just uh, killing this one. Here we go. Ambush. Nice, nice, nice. So we have like one one grenadier uh, back there. Can get uh, one grenadier back there. We're starting with suppressing them. We're staying like right near the charges here as well. The evac uh, was like right over there. So first of all, uh, this guy, 
gonna shoot uh, morale damage. Those boys. It's gonna break morale of this guy. And do some damage to this boy. So we can uh, we can shoot again with him. Oh, uh, we can shoot again with this guy. Seventy-two, fifty-nine. So he's on the ground. What's the plan? So I'll take this guy over here and stop uh, stop him. So that's uh, officer eliminated and getting six point out of this. So can go and shoot this guy again. Can go and shoot this guy. I mean, shoot like this guy over here. So this guy uh, planted a charge here, uh, not this guy, this guy planted a charge. Then we uh, shooting uh, shooting them in, in the face, like this. So one guy down. And we're shooting him in the face again. You're aiming too close. Vulnerable creed uh, damage, so... Yeah. Yes. Head. Head. I'm out. I have to reload. So we need to reload. Uh, you give in... Uh, okay, so... The How, how we have, how we have, if we go like over here, Moving. and we shoot this guy, too close. Watch your fire. that's like too close, we just shoot this guy vulnerable, or should I just stop him, like stop him like uh, without armor, right on okay here we go, shoot him good, So this guy uh, given a turn to to him. Mm hmm. Given a turn to him. Take the fight to them. And this guy. Uh, this guy resetting a turn of uh resetting the cooldown of this guy. What's up? And this guy giving uh giving a turn to to him. Alright. And this guy reloading. reloading. And this guy uh shooting this guy. Killing him, getting uh, additional. Okay, it's another get an IP. I already got like one IP out of this, and this guy is just uh, shooting, shooting this guy, trying to shoot it. Because there is nothing else. Uh, we, uh, do we do we just grenade it? Grenade not gonna kill it, but shooting maybe. There we go. A little bit of morale. The officer is uh, damaged. So you just uh, shooting this guy as well. We okay, good. reinforcements coming from that position. Uh, the grenade, uh, grenadier guy. Uh, okay, the officer. Oh wow, he actually missed. They actually missed. Uh, very, very impressive. Well, that, that's the wrong guy, dude. 
I'm low on ammo. So we uh, can guarantee kill this guy and get six points to get out of here. So we're reloading on him. Reloading on him. And um, it's a guarantee kill, right? So I don't need to uh, use my uh, stab. So killing him from, uh, from this position over here. There we go. Have six points. Uh, to move. Oh. Oh, me. Uh, so like, uh, so it will be hard to 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 shoot any of those guys from this uh, this position. Can tr try to do something about those guys coming. You want me? Yep. There are some guys over here, apparently. So, uh, we're moving this guy over here. What do we have? Have one guy. And there are probably more, more guys over there, too. So, uh, shooting this guy over here. 95 and, uh, 35. Well... Do we have a better choice? So some morale damage. I've been hit. Then uh, this guy can set a seven on him. Or uh, there's a better position for ninety-seven from here. Gonna get exposed to that to that other guy. What do you need? Moving. I think if we, if we just uh, trying to do uh, everything we can do with uh, with here. What do you need? And. Uh, Moving over here and um, getting him on our watch. So this guy is like, uh, what well, he problem is 37. They grenade him. It's not not enough to get get that morale damage up. Ninety-seven, but they're gonna be uh, exposed to this guy over there. Ninety-seven from here. Can expose uh, in both sides. So they should probably just just take this uh, this grenade damage over here, mate. Or I can go and stop him. Gonna get me exposed to that grenade guy, but I guarantee this guy not gonna not gonna do anything to me. Okay, there's four of those guys. Three, it's four, four. Break the morale right away. So like, well, this, this every watch is just just evil. Oh, there's oh my god, there there's the machine gunner. Machine gunner, they kill, they kill the officer. Check your sector. Stop shaking. They kill the Elven officer, which is good for me. Yeah? I guess. Remember your training. Magazines almost dry. So, uh, what are those guys? It's like what left for them. Can still go and shoot them, eliminating these reinforcements. Yeah. She's gonna leave my my people here uh, out and dry. You want me? Mm. Uh, can I feel bad? But I can move move this, can I? So uh, we're breaking the morale of those boys. Can shoot twice here. Yeah. Uh, 
35 and try to shoot uh, and kill this guy. 26%. It's near miss. Yep. So I can uh, have 80% on him, 88% from Move here. Is exposed. 88. So the, the, this guy out. What's the plan? So reinforcements out. Moving. Moving here. Okay, you're gonna be uh, just healing him. Uh, those guys have have uh, eyes on me from there. So you want to go and uh, just do some damage to this guy 17 16 to the face What's up? how much uh, we have from from this angle we have 67 67 on him and uh, well Not a good, not not the best angle, but duly noted. Uh, so like uh, this one, 73, 75, 73 on over here. Roger Dodger. You're getting uh, some turn here. You're gonna be reloading, shooting him and uh, reducing his morale. Actually, actually, 73%. So uh, maybe more prudent will be uh, shoot uh, shoot the guy with this with this guy here. They shoot him 67 and uh, breaking him, make him vulnerable. Yes. Uh, I've been hit. So have more uh, more chance to just uh, finishing him with him. For that critical damage. Securing the flank. It's broken. All right, those guys are just staying over there. They are trying to prevent me from getting up. So let's see, uh, I can't see anyone from here. But moving uh, this guy closer, it's... Uh, that's the stuff we need to do. Can I shoot him from, from here? Can I kill him from here? 51%. No, no, no. Well, he, he broke morale on him. So this guy need to reload. Hundred percent. Die, you scum. And I can move a little bit closer. What's cooking? So you are uh, can almost have okay. Can almost have a shot on this guy. Mm -hmm. Let's reload here. Reloading. Let's reload. Uh, decrease his morale a little bit. That's a lot of morale, he's suppressed. So you guys just move in. Hold your count. Check your sector. Check your sector. Those guys just gonna be going back uh, coming back from, from leaving. So you can kill him with him. Magazines almost dry. Uh put in put in charge over here. Should I put a charge over here? 
It's 12. I'm stabbing over this guy, moving, uh, resetting him. Okay, okay, so we're getting the charge over here. Moving. Enemy. Charge is planted. So there's a grenadier. How much? has 65 on him. It disrupted. So, uh, this guy giving a turn to him. So, uh, this guy reloading. And shooting this guy. Again, uh, me 65%. So this guy giving him a turn again. Oh. This guy gonna go and take uh giving a turn to this guy again. Take the fight to them. Alright. Yes. What do you need? So this guy gonna reload and shoot. Okay, so uh, he's broken. He's broken. We good. We good. Just need to get out of the of the ship next. Yeah. What's cooking? That's your service. So let's see. Uh, now now we need to do something with those guys. We, need, we can shoot with a five here. Seven. Uh, so we can move us eight. All right, seventeen percent on this. Try to break morale here. Okay, okay, okay. A little bit miscalculation, so I can uh, I can stop this guy. The machine gunner will be able to shoot unless you do something about it. But I guess I can't do anything about that. So let's get my uh, cooldown reload. Moving. Can try to shoot the machine gunner from here and remove his uh, morale. Alright. I got the morale back. Oh my god, that's the wrong guy. They moved the fucking wrong guy. Fuck. How did this happen? How did this happen? I saw we operating this guy. Uh, but if we move a different one here. Bloody hell, bloody hell, bloody hell. 75. Okay, we still can do something about it. So there's another guy over there. So you are refreshing his uh, his cooldown. Need to shoot those guys with uh, morale suppression thing. Break them completely. And I can still move after this. He doesn't have like ammunition here. Need to get him out of this place. Do 
you know like who, who's that guy was there. <sighs> Let's save your lot in here. And what we can do from, from this position? We can do very little. Little to nothing. The machine gunner guy. But who this? Like he can move at the when he doesn't have a turn. I can't. Yeah, yeah. That was our skin. Can get them as a grenade over here, can I? Not really. Oh, there's a sniper. Well, this guy is a sniper. Uh, sounds good. Sniper marked on, on this guy. As long as you're not shooting, we're good. All right, all right, all right, all right. Magazine's almost dry. Magazine's dry, so we can go and uh, hundred percent this guy. But what if we want? We want hundred percent this guy. My clip is almost empty. It's, uh, not be able to shoot for for long. So uh, we have an 84 in this guy from here. We also want to set a reset, a reset turn shit. Oh. Oh. So we definitely want to reset his his uh, ability. I want to take care of the bloody sniper, after all. Set his school down. See how that's gonna go. So, uh, the guy with a shotgun goes over here and shooting this guy in the face. 100%. Setting him, uh, his scroll down over here. I'm giving him additional turn. Reload in. Maybe we shouldn't like reload. Maybe we should like knife him. Oh, well, we're about to kill him. Anyway. Just mean I uh, still can do something to this guy. Well, nothing, uh, nothing but a grenade. That's what I can do. It's like a little bit morale damage. Yep. You want me? So the guy with the machine gun can move as much as eight over here. And still shoot. The spread is bad. What about here? Well, the spread is not not not, uh, not touching everyone. Um, not good. What about you? Uh, okay, 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 okay. So you can control him with a knife. So we're just shooting uh, one of those guys, 70%. Near a miss, but his morale is broken. 
So we are uh, just going and do something about this guy. Break his morale. Oh God, I'm hit. Keep them standing. And you are... Uh, need to oh. move over here. 97%. We need a six to uh, to shoot ninety five percent from here. That's uh, a chance to kill him. There we go. As good as we could could get it. So like as I, I guess like, uh, this guy can get closer. We can get into uh, into into the position from here. Um, so like, let's say this guy is just moving over here. Moving out. Is this close to uh, to evac zone. As close as we get, and we're shooting those guys over here. Pinning them down. So we're uh, bringing this guy over here and pinning this guy down. Stay strong, fight on. Okay, yeah. so reload if I understand. Honestly, we just can go and, and kill them now, yeah? Moving. Maybe that's a mistake. Um. Okay, they, they, they're far away, their reinforcements are like really far away, so... Don't really care about this reinforcements shit. And Savage is moving in position when he can evoc. There was some new submarine. Good. Okay, extract the mission, cool down reset. Uh, there is some enemies coming, be like good luck finding me. Unless they're super fast. Uh, Alright. How did this guy is not 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 close to to a vag zone? Oh yeah, because He's not that kind of a guy, is it? He's not an Ava kind of a guy. What? What do you need? They can break morale of those guys and uh, if I kill this guy, I'm out of here. Alright, this guy's broken. We keep the uh, Kim Kim broken. And this guy can get to the back point already. As well as you. Stop shaking. Remember your training. My comrades need me. So we're going over here and my scout uh my scout boy. Moving out. Out. Perfect mission. Perfect mission once again. Once for the team. Mission complete. Not that much of XP. 69 supplies. Yeah, give me, give me. And got like some semi auto rifle and uh, a new. The machine gun. So this guy is just level up. Maximum level. Continue. The D Day is like uh, was on two, so that's bring to zero, right? London broadcasts a poem by Paul Verlaine. We hear the last lines about the violins of the autumn song, and feel like we've been zip zapped by electricity. They're the code words we've waited for. The invasion is on. 
Out there is an armada of ships and planes, bringing men who count on us to keep the German 7th and 15th armies occupied until they're safe on French soil. Now is the time we get to work. Because this wasn't the final mission, is it? Uh, radicals, uh, relationships. Great work. After that strike, the dockyard resistance cells are in London's good books. London was hit bad by a rocket. Oh well, I mean. <sighs> the criminals, so uh, we're gonna get uh, this region plus under control. London wants us to hit this rocket site before it launches. She makes relations with criminals, uh, we just got. There's ambush and your region strength. So, uh, your relationship with British criminals. Objective complete, more FFI tokens. But uh, we, we still do a mission despite like the D days is there. I was what? Well, let's, let's save. Uh, let's save. Forty-three. It's just like uh, I. Yeah, we just like should be forty-four. Is it? Mission is uh, ambush. We identify the V2 launch site and expected a rocket to launch soon. A strike to take a rocket uh, and sight out of the commission will delay the deb uh, debut of the terror weapon. Uh, okay, there is no secondary objective there. No secondary objective is a radical faction. Uh, right. Replies in the street, so are we uh, knocking down this guy? No reprisal for you. Carl Muir, Miller down. We have conversation uh, conversation in uh, in the base camp. I swear, the crowds get more sinful every day. Do you believe in God, Major? I believe the Jesuit brothers fashioned me into a righteous weapon of vengeance against these God-hating heathens. <laughs> You should meet Sister Agatha from my grade school. Arm her with a ruler, and she'd win this war single-handed. Don't mess with a nun, brother. Alright. Uh, so we have full of doubts, uh, then a new uh, machine gun. Let's see how it's, uh, how it's comparable with my current machine gun. It's more morale damage, and giving you exposed. Okay, that's look uh, pretty good. In my book, memorize damage and give an exposed status. Yes, please. There was uh, also a new rifle, is it? So less damage, less morale damage and less accuracy. Okay, okay. We can uh, leave that be. So King uh, and Lamy are tired. I'm gonna give them a rest. Uh, we can customize uh, some skills for uh, Cassidy get uh, his uh, two skills back. So we get uh, IP and kill, we get a rifle damage here. Sure. Rifle damage. Cover bonus, a dot chance. Actually, there is another rifle bonus. Morale, melee skill, maximum health. So he's not so easily to defeat it. I shall give him a more morale. Alami well, got plus two. Machine gun and AP not reduced when suppressed, which is like interesting. require two the bullet storm let's take the bullet storm I can do something as my IP 
Those guys out of the uh, picture. So look at this objective started ticking again. It's one out of three, but I already was a two out of three. So we should uh, technically complete this objective right now. So missing like 60 supplies here. Uh, yeah, kind of feels bad. Let's see what we can do with uh, the factions here. Criminals faction. Well. I can get a great many things at fair prices. Armor, morale, uh, resistance, morale damage. Uh, this one, morale accuracy. Morale 24, stunned. So... We have, we have, we have a good gun already. Health, uh, morale. So maybe get uh, this for ladies. Firearm damage, health, so we don't care American about firearm. Uniform. Wearing the wrong colors is a capital offense. They won't tolerate a spy. Right, 11 damage here and uh, three a lot. So this is looking good. More damage. Right, like more, way more, more, more damage. Let's spread a uh, less IP to the Lord. So I think I'll take it. I think I'll take it. So we wanted the shotgun here. No question asked. A sniper rifle with the same creed, more morale damage and more accuracy. Which is also if looking they good. Find British or Americans wearing French colors, they will call you a spy. So there's action points. Uh, this one uh, worse than my current one, and uh, that's the criminals. What about this faction over here? We have this one. There's another shotgun, ten damage, but uh, it's have chance to stun. Female union from with health and with fire cost minus one. That's a British uniform. If they catch non-British wearing that, they will be and shot radicals. As a spy. Radicals, radicals, radicals. So eleven damage with this shotgun, shotgun and bleeding. Same morale damage. There's uh, the valiant machine gun. Is the one we already have? Is it? It's already the, uh, the one we just got. Is it? So what about this one? Same, almost same. That's female. That's a male. Health. Armor plus two. It's a lot of armor. So I do interest in this 26 morale damage gun here and exposed. We probably, uh, what we're gonna do, we uh, definitely buy in the, the shotgun here. Uh, the shotgun, the shotgun, where I was. This one. Oh, it's just, okay, it's, uh, around shotgun. This, this one. Nope. It's a radical shotgun. Radical didn't even have a shotgun. Nine damage. Did you compare to the king's shotgun? It was the one who went on a mission. There it is. Nine damage. Okay, it's a reload, a reload AP3. Okay, I'll, I'll, gonna, I'll gonna take this one. I'm gonna take this one, confirm. If anyone asks you where you got that, you did not get it from me. Yeah, so a lot of doubts. A uh, lot of doubts. She's going on the next mission. Uh, she's going on the next mission, so uh, we're getting him, uh, her, the, the, the new shotgun here. My damage, less AP to reload. Alright. And, uh, well, Alami had, so the, the Valiant, right, that's, that, that's exactly that machine gun I was, like, uh, looking at. So 
Valen shotgun, uh, machine gun. Exactly the one I was looking for. Uh, so about the claws, about the claws. Uh, let's see. Browse at your own pace. Again, Unless the judge. This, it does have more, more moral damage actually, more moral damage than than the Valiant as well, but reloading costs in a uh, more, uh, which is okay. Not really. I mean, you can uh, shoot twice. Yeah, I, I think I think we just uh, stick in with my Valiant one. Made to fit the ladies. Well, our resistance cover bonus is like twenty only. If they find British or Americans wearing French colors, it's like morale damage here plus plus eight. Firearm damage. Two health and accuracy. And action points and uh, so do allow me uh, have action points. So let's see. Uh, let's see actually what everyone wearing here. Uh, also appearance. So you are. We have a decent uh, helmet here, armor, morale, recovery, chest. We have a health, maximum morale, cover bonus, legs. Uh, we need a legs for, uh, for that action points. Okay, action points here. You granted. This one have action points, and his. Uh, okay, action points here. Uh, action points here, and this guy has wearing uh, something, uh, something boorish. So we need a British one, more British with action points for Johnson. You are wearing the one with action points and maximum morale. And another French guy also wearing action points and dodge. Okay. When it's come for chest armor, you're wearing like plus one armor. Another guy uh, wearing uh, nothing, wearing nothing. So you can uh, get some French armor, good. You have plus health, health uh, and dodge. So British uniform, British uniform and French uniform for uh, action points that we can buy. Bienvenue. Let's see, uh, French for health, firearm damage, morale damage. Or oh, we can we can get this one. Thirty-five. If they find British or American, uh, all right. Health, morale, resistance, cover. I'll take it too. Made to fit the ladies. stitch to whatever fit you need. French health and accuracy. So French is action point over here. Uh, we'll take it. So what else would we have here? Uh, female health, firearm, I am fire cost. French. That's a British uniform. British health, okay. You, British we do need this. That, they will be shot as a spy. Oh, we need this. Good on you. French morale, donors carry uh, maximum morale, morale resistance. Also French. Do need some some good hat over uh, there. And radicals. American uniform. If you are not a Yank, they will shoot you as a spy just for wearing it. Uh, well, this is not bad, is it? So, there's two armor. Uh, we definitely want this one. A fine fit. British morale, maximum morale. And health, uh, I am at fire ghost. Merci. So we can take all of those. Let's go to the doubts. So no supplies, no supplies at all. Snap it, uh, dresser, buy 15 items of apparel. Uh, okay, okay. So Cassidy uh, has a new jacket. Firearm health, uh, more health, maximum morale, or firearm damage, fire uh, costs. I think aim and fire costs for him is better, right? 
That was the idea. So King uh, have some something of a chest armor here. So he's wearing uh, not health. This one can go through health. And maximum morale, cover bonus. Fire M damage. Okay, any fire arm damage. Okay, you know what? Maybe keeping his fire arm damage here yeah, for him. So he has only dodge here. And this guy only has as a machine gunner. One more health, carry bonus and shit. Uh, well, do dodging for dodging for, for my. Guy is okay too. Kind of French here. We have chest and legs. Uh, start with the legs, right? He's wearing plus action points. This guy not wearing action points. Wait, they both like wearing action points. What the fuck? Why do you need action points there? Dude. Just wasted my. Uh... So those guys, the British, didn't have action points, pants. He's wearing armor. He's wearing nothing. This can give him like firearm damage. Morale uh, morale damage. Morale damage good for him. And head. So be wearing uh, morale damage 17. And he's wearing cover bonus morale recovery. And give him armor. And cover bonus. Uh, morale damage, which is good for uh, This is maybe good for machine gun or two Well, okay machine gunner does have morale damage. No mind. No mind. No mind And ladies ladies uh, Can get a better uniform here health morale resistance what whatever right so we uh, got this guy down at least I'll ambush um, the difficulty is lethal shot the difficulty is lethal I'm gonna take you I'm gonna take you and gonna Maybe should take a Cassidy. I don't want to two girls in one team. All right. Uh, so let's see about the weapons. The so Cassidy have uh, the best gun uh, so far. All right. The King uh, not going. This, uh, this guy have the best gun so far. This guy can uh, do want to to actually take this Valiant gun. Okay, we good. And uh, the medic girl have 11 damage to shotgun. Oh, there's nine damage to the shotgun. Okay, she, she, she have the right shotgun as well. All right, we good. Uh, the girl, however, can check out if you wear any right headpiece gear. Morale, maximum morale. Okay, that's the right one. And legs, uh, she has a pants with action points, okay. She's good. So this is our team. We don't do anything on the global map, do we? We have four FAI tokens, uh, I don't need to, to train anything more. I don't need to do anything else here. Like we're just uh, jumping uh, straight into the mission. Demolish rockets, stop the rocket launch. Non-secondary objectives again. Zero days. We need to stop that V2 from launching. Move quickly. Oh, 
this stuff is huge. Four people. Uh, we definitely don't want to see a sniper here. And want to, to probably kill this guy as well. So where's my uh, scout? Oh wait, he, he can't he can't reach this guy. We can we can kill this guy. It's not a priority to target. By any means, it's just normal normal soldier. So now the sniper over there. That'd be problematic, like very problematic. You need me? Uh, he go into this position. Do we, uh, why don't we have like the evac point here? That's the problem. Why there is no whack point? I'm moving. I'll move more. Okay, we try to hide over here. You want me? How you going? Try to hide over here. Bring them all together. Okay, we can uh, speed this up a little bit. So now the guy was there. Yeah. Really don't need to kill this guy right now, but... Staring yeah. around. Getting, uh, get, uh, get, uh, giving him a turn. Okay, you're not turning around anywhere. So there is a stall that we need to disable. Maybe I shouldn't kill that, 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 that last guy. Moving. moving, moving, moving. Come on, guys. There's another guy like going over there, so that could be uh, dangerous. Don't have visuals on him, don't know what, what he's thinking. What's up? Hopefully, it's not uh, some kind of uh, sniper guy. Hopefully this this is a safe location. So disabling that uh gonna provoke some guys okay, sniper over here. It's going over there. Uh can hide over here. Because patrolling and stuff, that, that, that's a thing. We need probably to kill him. Because the noise of a uh, disabling generator could make. And that's mean they're gonna be spinning an ambush, is it? 
Okay, let's put all, all, all the people here, which is... I mean, they're not getting flank. At least doesn't look like they're gonna be flanked by this. Or get get themselves in a pincer attack like uh, we got in, in, in a previous couple of maps. Okay, move here. My enemies is going uh going to go back. I can safely move over here. Moving out. I'm getting closer to that uh, generator. Again, I believe it's gonna produce the noises. If we try to cut uh, if we try to cut it. So that's uh, a little bit problematic, like way too more problematic. Okay. So do you think are those guys gonna die here on this mission? Cause there is no relax zone. We just like stop stop the rocket and that's all. And it's was like brutal as well. So I do have some, some apprehension of some sad realization of what could happen. Actually, uh, probably want uh, this girl. Uh, yes. This girl over here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anything she can cut and uh, get inside and do do whatever she can there. I'm here. Yeah. Yeah. So if it didn't, didn't uh, okay, okay. So didn't need to kill this guy, and then only then we can disable generator. But that's gonna spawn a uh, spawn an ambush. So killing the sniper was there was a mistake. Killed too many, too many things. Okay, so we go in your uh, put in your way here. And we just kill him there. Uh, this guy is gonna be spawned the ambush. We have some guy over there. So uh, the guy with uh, machine gun can put him uh, in this position over here. And uh, you are. Well, I guess. Because this position is still okay. Okay, here we go, the ambush. We've got the element of surprise. Attack! Element of surprise. Uh, all right, all right, all right. So. Watch your fire! 70% What's cooking? We're gonna go and uh, disable this shit so may, 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 Maybe maybe I done it uh, Maybe I done it wrong Maybe I should like uh, Yeah, shoot him first then uh, What's the plan? Prosthetic will downs so she's 100% on this guy, surprise I don't. Uh, she's cutting the shit here. I'm up now. She's I'm open, up now. Uh, open the shit here. Opposition. She disable the shit. I'm up now. Yes. Then the, uh, the charges. All over the place. Shooting him in the face. 
There we go. We give it, giving her a turn. Sure, lot in here. I'm still shooting him in the face. I can have uh, shoot this guy in the face. Okay, shooting this guy in the face. Kill confirmed. We got a nice action. Shooting him in the face. Uh, so this guy can shoot him in the face. And probably need to move closer here. So now there was a sniper over there. And we know there's some guy over here. You want me? What's up? Uh, so what let's see. Uh, Moving out. I can see him from here as a grenadier. And I can stop him in the tracks if I uh, reset cooldown for this guy. Oh. Yeah. Sure. I'm shooting him. Uh, he's suppressed. I'm giving him a turn. Take the fight to them. Yeah. Probably reloading here. Just in case, because we can, and we're getting, uh, we're staying close here. There we go, additional morale damage. So when this guy want to, uh, want to move closer. More Germans, there is a guy with a machine gun. This guy trying to put it together. Uh, the sniper, a uh, sniper there, the one who didn't dispose of. Keep your eyes open. Must fight okay, uh, can I put uh, this guy somewhere where you can uh, shoot all of them and suppress? Like, uh, suppressing the, them, them from here. Come out 12. Oh, I can try to suppress this guy from here. Morale damage is uh, gonna get him suppressed, guaranteed. And I can still shoot out from there. Uh, she doesn't need to reload. Nothing uh, can be done about that. And we can cut through here. 16, 16. I can get her like out of this place. Let them uh, come a little bit closer. Four or seven uh, to move. I'll not be able to jump down there, will I? Yep. You want me? Um. Okay. So how how are we looking, looking over here? I'm not looking that bright. Yeah. Absolutely need to, need to do this uh, suppression from machine gunner. Okay. There's like uh, n nothing, nothing uh, done with that. Uh, well, we can skip shooting. We? The sniper gonna get to me, and it'll be like really bad. Can get over here seven plus four, eleven. Then we're moving like over here, and so we can shoot. Uh, no, not. I'm up uh, so we're gonna get them a turn to move. Okay, okay, okay. Not really in in a good position here with this guy. What's cooking? 
Uh, let's say we can move this guy here. We need five to shoot. Eighty-seven. Okay, we're eighty-four from the on this guy already. But we're not really in any good position to shoot. I don't really want to put him like in the open here. So eight. Can try to eight and five. Eight seven and five. Move it. So we can move a little bit closer over here. And up. still shoot him. Okay. And well, we can move this guy over here, 57, 85. My flank is exposed. We reload for three and shoot for one. Okay, I almost killed him, but uh, it's not, not really. So instead of... Uh, Healing him. How about we just uh, overwashing him? Please make it stop. Stop shaking. Remember your training. Got put a mark on me. Okay, morale. Uh, she's suppressed. She'll be fine. Not how I die. She'll be fine. She went to move over there. Uh, those guys just uh, just fin uh, finish him, him off. 85, and then I can uh, can I can I shoot anyone from from here? 45. I can't, I can't, and there's more more guys coming from this position. So I go killing him, and yeah, we need to take care of those guys here. There's three three guys and one machine gunner. To take care of them first somehow. So we definitely want to reload. Just have uh, a, 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 a surplus of points here. And let's say like a, a shooting them from here. 85. Oh damn it! I didn't didn't kill him. That could be bad. Alright, so uh, she can go over there and try and shoot both of those guys. 12. 11, she has 15 points. So 32 and 79. It's getting. Oh uh, uh, my god. It's not, not gonna get this guy shot, huh? So we only can I can shoot both of them, hit morale damage at least from this position. Morale damage. Morale damage. What do you want? What's up? Uh give her a turn. Give the lady a turn. Not even enough like morale damage there to, to do something about those guys. Hopefully I can kill the guy, but... Can I soft, it, uh, soft him out oh. somehow? Yeah. Like if I move this guy over here and shoot. Eight, five. So move him over here. Reducing him morale damage. Can break uh, this guy. I'm not able to break this guy, so. Damn it. Uh, can yeah. this guy do something? Helping us break in morale. So, for straighten, he can, he can shoot here. So, we need to five. We need to move five. Five as much as we can move here. 
Really in a bad position here, am I? Shouldn't shouldn't uh, get her in, in the trenches there. That was a big mistake. Getting her in the trenches was a big mistake shot. I don't know why I did it. I don't know. I want to, to shoot on this guy. How much? Am, uh, I don't have a go any good pistols here, do I? Any good pistols in, the, in terms of morale damage? So I'll say move this guy over here and try to, to shoot this guy. 50% morale disrupted. So then I shoot in this guy with uh, okay, fulfill morale here. Firing. Right, so he's uh, he's broken, he's What's broken. Let's see if I uh, I have four aim at fire here, so we can move as much as four over here. As much as four. Move it. Let's say if I try to uh, to shoot him. So she need, need to move like over there in that position. Weak. So she's moving like over here. The, the, yeah. This guy is still shooting. She's got exposed. And she's getting closer over here. Uh, over here and shooting this 99%. All right, do the crit, girl. That's as much as we could do. There's four people over here. Uh. So what is this guy gonna do? That guy didn't done anything. Well, apart from uh, putting himself on guard. Yeah. All right. So look, uh, let's say we can kill this guy again. Try it, 85. And then we can uh, do a little bit of damage on those guys. Originally, I probably would like to move here, 82, and this guy. Then we're loading. And we're moving for high cover. So we want to uh, expose, uh, dispose of those guys first. I'm low on ammo. Uh, this is like a guy with lower armor. So we need to interrupt this guy over there. Can shoot for four still from here. All right. Moving. Oh my God! Like how? How is my uh? Do it. Like, Really, really, okay. We're interrupting him. Take a pill. That was like really bad. <laughs> Again. So she's reloading. She can take care of this guy. No problem. Can do some damage on this guy as well. Can I get both? Like uh, forty percent, thirty-nine percent. Uh, again, hundred percent, and uh, eighty-four. Do you know we can shoot him from here? Hundred percent and eighty-five. Can I do this? Like eighty and eighty-five over there. Yes. Come on, girl. Show me some guts. Show me some enemy guts. It's a hundred percent on this guy. But how, how did, oh my, he, he dodged 100%. He dodged the 100%, that's what happened. So this guy is moving over here. There's 82% of them there. And uh, we're just trying to shoot this guy over here. 
Okay. Yep. Good confirmed. And more enemies coming. More reinforcements coming. You want me? Uh, so we want to do something with this guy. And, uh, and unfortunately can can't really like stop him. The damage is also like minimum. So they're taken over here. Uh, 97 from here. Probably gonna be shooting this guy. What's the plan? If this guy had uh, has a way to shoot him. What about grenade? Can't reach this grenade. Moving. We're putting him in uh, in, in a uh, cover, in solid cover. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Critical, um... Uh, well, let's, let's try to put a mark on him. Very inconvenient, and just 100% crit. The stream morale is suppressed. Well, guys, coming from from uh, right behind me. Please make it stop. So the those guys back. try and trying to uh, get around, and we good there. Too close. Twenty-two morale damage. We uh, can handle that. Okay, there's uh, way way more guys than I was I bargained fight. for. Um, she's reloading. She's reloading. So like hundred percent on this guy. So we're getting closer, and uh, it's just point blank him. Mary. Oh my god, he dodged me twice. Twice point blank. Really? How do you dodge like the shrapnel from a shotgun in point blank? That's the bullshit. What do you want? What's up? Take the fight to them. That's like co complete and utter bullshit. You know that that dodging is just gonna uh gonna wreck me over here. Whenever she's go up here, she can't she can target that guy. What's cooking? Uh, I do have some visuals on him from here. So let's say we go in. Uh, we can go as fine as five here. Yep. What's the plan? The machine gunner need need to reload soon. So that's what I'm doing. Roll the machine gunner and put him over here. Is that? Just like what else? Put him here in, uh, in an ambush. Can I? Reload plus three. So moving here uh, in the six. Move it. Well, there was there was that guy over there. Where that guy was there, unfortunately. Let's carry this area a little bit uh, wider. Twenty-five. I can't reach. Uh, I can't reach this thing. Uh, so you can uh, get as close as here and get his morale damage on. It is broken. I probably want to get this guy also as close as possible. I do some morale damage on this guy. Well, he did uh, shoot him. Land six different shots with a less than 25% chance. Okay. Living the life here. 
Remember your training. So we're trying to go around here. Courageous inspired. We got inspired this guy. Oh well, he, he got, he, he's a courageous guy. Near me is, uh, I see, I see. So he didn't take any morale damage. So says guys, a like Gestapo. So one turn until uh, there's reinforcements over there. Okay, all right, all right, all right. So those guys are courageous. We can't, we can't. Uh, we can bloody uh, reduce their morale here. Which is bullshit. We need, we need to go and kill them. Normal way. Can uh, or I just hide from them over here? So maybe all my all my, all my people to this position. Still need to b blow up this thing. So this we, we, we're setting up the charge here. Setting up a charge. Sixty-nine. Can I kill this guy? No, I can't. So we're uh, definitely moving this guy somewhere over here. There's just no way to around it. 45 on this guy. 45 on this and breaking his morale. At your service. What's so up? you're gonna move uh, right over here and shoot him 97. It's not gonna kill him, is it? You want me? Yeah. What about the shotgun oh. girl? 70, uh, so we can go like as close as over here. 184. Let's see about this. 100%, 80% on him, or on 84 on him. Oh God. Last round. I need to um, so we're gonna cool down here for now. Get get her a turn. Move it, you apes. Moving your apes. Okay, she's reloading. Eighty four hundred. Did he just like dodge that? You bastard. Dodge this. Bon Alright, bon voyage. So one charge saddle. Um, yep. What's the plan? So this guy over here. I almost like... I almost, uh, almost think I'm putting just... He's in our watch over here. What's cooking? Uh, so he can go as far as five over here. I still shoot, but then we need to reload. They're breaking all his morale here. He's pinned down. Him. And you can get like over here and hundred percent on him. On my flank. Sure. To the head. Okay. Again in the machine gunner, um can put it over here. And put uh, this uh, overwatch in this area over here. Be courageous, there are more enemies coming from this side, so I need to move my, my boys away. I don't really want to engage them. Uh, there's a machine gunner, uh, a grenadier. 
all bad, bad kind of stuff. Okay, get the man walk in. Stop, please. Stop very trash. Okay, give uh, him a turn, is it? Uh, he's got the center and uh, which is not good. Never been. He's like right behind, uh, behind there. Uh, so how do we do it? How do we do it? I gotta reload. Can I can I stop this guy? Yeah, he has so much armor. Like just no way the knife gonna work on this guy. So don't endure a lot. A grenadier coming uh, and yeah, like more enemies from that side. At least uh, three enemies over here as well. We'll try to flank them, but so it's hundred percent and uh, a good chance to kill him. Make me too exposed to that grenadier guy. So we need to move, but that's also ma uh, gonna make me expose over there. So there's any uh, any good place so I can move to, to this position. Yep. Uh, I she have to reload too. Reloading. She can get like uh, as far as uh, also this position and just waiting them to come here. Maybe that's what to do. And this guy is just uh, running, running, running over here. What's the plan? Okay, so like, uh, let's say uh, this guy go over here. Moving. And shooting this guy to death. Cover load there. He's did he just? Flank him. Dude, did he just miss again? Like, oh my lord, but did he just miss again? And did we not like, have a point? Uh, let's put in this guy exposed here. What a bullshit. Okay. She got him. She got like a uh, that sector clear. So we put in uh, the machine gunner over here. Eight and twelve. All uh, right, all right, all right. Come here if you can get me. So this guy can can get a uh, flank me can flank my machine gunner if he move. Doesn't look he's moving. I have a target. Yes, please. <laughs> Last round. I need to reload. Okay. Not really. Stay medic. As morale, those guys are securing the flank, uh, so we can get her over here and try to get set the charges. Give me a moment, chat. Give me a moment. Is anyone else like streaming classified right now? They are like, because I was wondering why when we have two people for for whole uh, two hours here. And Richard also wants something. Uh, give me a second. I'm gonna I'm gonna pacify the Richard. We'll be back in a moment. Richard is my cat.
All right, I'm back. Thank you very much for waiting. Uh, we're good. As good as we could be. Uh, so we need to heal this guy. You want me? I am out of ammo. Where, where she is? She also needs to reload. Uh, so she's feeling him. Never felt better. Getting some additional action points here. And she's reloading with those action points. This guy looks soft, like in terms, like you know, in terms of his armor. So zero percent chance on this guy, but we have some morale damage on him too. 17, 18, uh, 62 if I go like over there. What's up? Yeah. Um. What's the plan? Oh. So let's yep. see. Let's see. Can I kill him? Not really. Yeah. Uh, right, right, so we do need to reload him. Five and four, nine. So I can still, like, uh, shoot that Gestapo guy. And try to remove morale from this guy over right here. What's the plan? And do something about this three percent. Three percent. And set up the charge there and sacrifice myself. The hundred percent if I shoot him over here. Moving out. Maybe I uh, can soften enough uh, him for for the other guy. Hundred percent if you get a uh, zero percent over here, but it's seventy-five. On this guy, a little bit of morale damage on him. And uh, we can't we can touch this guy, so. Just kind of bad. The machine gunner, so. Machine gunner can go over here. And uh, moving like six here. Can reduce the morale of both of those guys. Move it! Sure. Pin down. Flank em. So ping them down, flank them. The girl uh, with a shotgun go and shoot this. What's so you are shooting this guy. There we go. We got exposed. So she's gonna go and shoot him I'm in the face. My flank is exposed. I'm being flanked. We didn't dodge nice. And I'm moving her a little bit and uh shooting out the guy. That's thirty percent to uh, suppress him. Can try to shoot this fifty three. They all stay together for for that for that uh oh well fine, it's fine for the grenade. <laughs> fifty three do it. There we go. You want me? Can give uh, the turn to to other guys too. So like six turn to her. She's out of ammunition, is it? She's out of ammunition, but I can give uh, the turn to him. He can get over here and shoot him again. Take the fight to them. Maybe that's a, a slight Maybe. mistake. So get morale back. So twenty one percent on this. Moving. That's grenadier. You can see me. He's in my sights. I'm right. didn't suppress him. Uh, more reinforcements coming in one turn. Okay, okay, okay. That's good. But we don't know what this. Uh, how much of damage this guy can do. 
Securing the flank. Oh, he's just securing the flank. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh. That's absolutely good. Yeah? I have to reload. Reloading. Reloading. Um. So we can put a uh, the sink over here in sufficient IP. And still probably shoot. Depending on how I put her. 0%, uh, 3%, 5%. Five percent is not the zero. So his morale is uh, broken. Then we're taking my uh, scout over here. And setting out all the charges here. Should reload, but. Okay, so demolition. Uh, three. Three turns to wait. But where where is the extraction point? <laughs> Don't tell him it's back here. More enemies are coming. Get out. So uh, this whole thing's gonna gonna be blowing up. Moving. So we just moving over here, taking a position uh, over here. So that guy gonna be blowing up uh, together with my charges. Uh, we can take uh, my sector. So he uh, he does he does have like two two more movement points over here. Moving. Where he counts reinforcements. Stop shaking. Remember your training. Check your sector. Securing the flank. Securing the flank. Okay, so I gotta reload. I need to move, put him uh, in a position where he can shoot and reload, and you know. Wait, they should like a uh, knife him. Knife not gonna do much. Uh, where, where is the girl? My clip's almost empty. Well, it's like uh, we can get like her over, over here. Fourteen and shoot him in the face. This is better. Uh, is it better What's for up? him to shoot first? Because yeah. uh, giving her a critical. Please. Suppressed. You do your job. Is recovering. Okay, let's reload those boys. Okay, two turns until uh, all of this blow up to pieces. Okay, with the area, reload the machine gunner. This guy gonna blow up with, with, with the shit, right? So like, Reloading. don't really uh, care about staying here. But we want, we want to uh, get out of this place as far as possible. Moving. What do you want? I am Same the goes for her. Reloading. Those guys uh, keep watching. Covering the area. Again, we, we don't know like where is the extraction point. And very suspicious as uh, oh. the boys are uh, camping over there. So meaning we probably would need to go oh, through this area back. Okay, here we go. Big boom. London is safe today. 
Have we done enough to stop the invasion? Have we done enough? Okay, we don't don't even need to evac here. Mission complete. Heroic victory. Have we done? St we blow up a rocket. Is it, it, invasion stopped? Right? They de definitely not invading any moon uh, anytime soon. This rocket uh, in dispose. Okay, she's maxed level. Continue. And also perfect mission. Like I'm I'm so good at this game, am I? The cavalry arrives. Gary Cooper kisses Faye Ray. Or was it Mary Bryan? They ride off into the sunset. The end in big capitals. The it's war the hero. End, is it? It's never the end. Not for us. Achievement lot. Not for the French. Certainly not for the crowds. I watched the dog faces coming up the road, on the road to Paris and then Berlin. For a moment, I got to feel just swell. But I knew it was only a matter of time before they patched me up and I followed. It's not the end, no. But the end... The end is beginning. Feel the region, so like we have a uh, res resistance region. The only one is not feel is uh, okay. This one, elite region strength. Didn't reach like this this point over there. D day. Yeah, I should have like more more actual time for me to complete the missions. So I probably can, can reach this uh, mineral victory. Historical result, the invasion is successful. The resistance was successful in trying up to a second line and reserve uh, German uh, units. The allies come ashore, but the Americans have bogged down at the beaches uh, and the British are unable to reach a uh, can on schedule. It will be a long wait before the breakout come. You couldn't mistake what was happening. The sky was black with aircraft. We heard the distant sound of bombs and saw smoke on the far horizon. We knew the invasion had come. It was now our time. The resistance groups we'd trained came out of hiding to blow up railroads, cut wires, and attack the Germans. Many French were sick of occupation and wanted to fight. The Krauts gave them a fight. We lost many Patriots that first day. We knew this was as much a civil war as a fight for liberation. The resistance attacked police, milice, collaborators. The milice fought like demons, knowing what would happen if they lost. De Gaulle's free French led the charge, and battles rumbled on for hours. Meanwhile, in Normandy, Waves of men splashed ashore, linking up with parachutists who'd dropped inland. On the right and left flanks, British, Canadians, and Americans fought their way off the beach. At Omaha Beach, casualties were heavy, but they eventually made it past the shore defenses. We'd helped by keeping the Germans baffled or busy. Halted by roadblocks, sabotage, and air attacks, the Kraut reserves couldn't stop the march ashore. Not all went to plan. The British failed to take Khan and are now fighting field by field through dense hedgerows. The American beaches still haven't linked up, and the Germans contest every yard of ground. The work of liberation has only just begun. The resistance networks have swung behind de Gaulle's free French and are busy preparing for the Allied breakout. With so much work still to do, I know we will prevail and liberate France. As the Prophet said, Is not this the task that I have chosen? To loose the bands of wickedness, to undo the heavy burdens, and to let the oppressed go free, and that ye break every yoke. Here, with the men and women of France, I keep the faith. Sixteen mission, uh, William Cassidy. 
Follow the liberation of Paris. Willard was assigned to create a new team of uh, Dutch Chad Burgers. In late 1944, they were parachuted into the occupied Holland and uh, supported the offensive known as Operation Market Garden. However, the Dutch resistance was compromised and uh, Willard barely escapes his life. Willard was demolished with the rank of major after the war ends, but returned as a reserve colonel in 1951 when the uh, Korean War uh, flared up. There, he helped organize rescue uh, services uh, for downed pilots behind enemy lines. Demolish it again. Demobilize again, sorry. Uh, Willard worked uh, in the air char uh, charter business, organizing uh, clandestine transportation for the CAI. Retiring in 1955, 55, 85. He died in a car accident in 1997. Done 16 missions here. The Tom the King, 16 missions as well. After linking up his allies' armies uh, after the breakout from Normandy, the Tom continued for a while to organize free French partisans further soft in uh, Witchy. In the later part of 1944, he was involved in FFI efforts uh, to capture Vichy police uh, and milice collaborators and bring uh, them to justice. Tom remained uh, in the British Army after the war end, serving uh, in the Palestine and the Greece before assigning uh, as the French Army liaison during the 1956 Suez Canal invasion. Disillusioned after the Suez crisis, Tom left the army and settled in the uh, Rhodesia to work as a journalist in uh, Salisbury. Concentrated about uh, rising violence, the Tom returned to the Britain uh, before Susan um, is in a 1980 election victory. Zanus, or whatever the uh setting down uh, roots in the uh, Surrey. He passed away after a short illness in 1990. Ten missions for Charles. After Normandy break out, uh, the Charles would continue to fight until the liberation of the Paris. Afterwards, he returned to the uh, Tours to help the uh, tribunal process the trials of the Hendricks collaborationists. He was able to prevent uh, his father's arrest and trial on the charges of being a German sympathizer. After the war, Charles returned to the teaching, however, he was soon elected mayor of the commune uh, of Metre in a municipal election in 1947 under the banner of the uh, Rosenband. Okay, well, that's the French, I can't read the French. In 1953, he stepped down from the uh, mayoralty to become an inspector in the Minister of Education, in which role he served until their retirement in 1985. Plagued by the wartime injuries, Charles would pass peacefully in 1995. 20 munitions for Vincent. That, that's, that, this guy done the, the biggest job out of whole team there. No, no uh, question there. Following the liberation of Paris, Vincent was reassigned to a new uh, pathfinder force. Task was securing a landing group's uh, grounds for airborne drops. He was to play um, an important part in Operation uh, Varsity to cross uh, the crossing of Rhine in uh, March uh, 1945, guiding uh, glider troops of uh, the 6th Airborne Division safety down while under the fire. After the war, Vincent returned to Canada. He rejoined the army in 1950 to find uh, the United Nations troops in Korea, uh, with United troops, not, not fighting them. In April uh, 1951, his unit, uh, the 2nd Battalion, the Princess Patricia's Canadian Light Infantry, was surrounded by the Chinese in the uh, Capong River Valley after the uh, Australian and American support had failed, have fled. Running low on ammunition, Vincent led many aggressive patrols against the Chinese positions. On 24 April 1951, he failed to return from one such patrol. His body was never recovered. The, the guy who done the, the, the biggest job died early compared to other teammates, Oli Johnson. When Paris fell to the Allies, Oli was recalled to London. After a period of the uh, recuperation, he was transferred uh, east and joined uh, the Australian 21st Brigade before taking part in the 1945 invasion of Barrera. 
As a commander, he fought against the Japanese uh, until the resistance ceased in the end of July. At the end of the war, Oli remained in the Australian army, spending a brief time in Japan with the occupation forces. During the Korea War, he was based in the Waga Waga, training soldiers of the Royal Australian Regiment. In 1956, he was deployed as a staff officer to Malay, a resume operation in the Perak against the communist insurgents. insurgents. Leaving the army in 1967 at the rank of major, he established the successful import business in uh, Brisbane before retiring in early 1980s. He's passed away after the short illness in 1993. Sami Alami. Following the liberation of Paris, the French provisional government ordered Sami to demola, uh, demobilize. He was sent to the barracks in uh, Castel, uh, Castel Dowry with other North Amer African troops, pending uh, their repatriation to Morocco. After a short time the, uh, there, Sami absconded and spent the rest of the war working with a resistance. After the war, Willard and uh, the OSS helped Samuel travel to America. There, he was encouraged by uh, promises of citizenship to work for the National Intelligence Authority and later the CAI. Returned to Morocco, he infiltrated the uh, Istiqual party in Casablanca, providing the US intelligence and uh, anti French activity. On anti French activity. Following a Moroccan independence, Sami and his family moved to America, becoming citizens and setting near the San Antonio, de Texas. After career training uh, horses, Sami passed in 1990. Lily. Lily. After the uh, Allied arrived in Paris, Lily found her service unwanted. The new Gaullist uh, provisional regime has no space for the uh, accomplished women. Uh, instead, in the remaining months of war, she found herself performing uh, pastoral works for her father's church, uh, particularly towards the poor and war wound wounded. After the war, Lily found work rebuilding a number of the Paris libraries. Her collection uh, has suffered under the heavy hand of the occupation censors. She eventually joined the American li uh, Library in Paris in 1955 and served as the chief librarian until her Premature retirement in 1967 due to the ill health. Awarded the Legion of the uh, Honor. Honor. She wrote uh, the, her memoirs and also a history of the resistance and the ground press that was uh, for many years a standard work. She passed away after a short illness in 1975. Anna. The, the girl who, who annihilate people. After the de Gaulle entered at the Paris in triumph, Anna soon found herself sidelined by the uh, new regime. She found her leadership went uh, unrecognized and did not fight against for the rest of the war. Disarmed by the provisional government, Anna was uh, shuffling into the secretary work in the country's new judiciary. After the war, disgusted uh, by the patriarchal turn of the new French regime, Anna joined one of her friends many socialists clubs, becoming a union organizer. Uh, disenchanted by the communists uh, at the start of the Cold War, she became involved with the Social Democratic uh, Workers' Force and was to play a significant role in the events of the main uh, 1968 negotiation the Grenial Agreements. After a long career as the union deputy, she re retired to uh, Amins and passed uh, the away peacefully in 2002. So she lives the longest in terms of well, she she, she died the, the the last of them. Hopefully, this is not a copyrighted video. <laughs>
Well, we did help here with the D-Day, did we? That many, many people, many, many lives were lost here. Many lives indeed. Right, that's all. That's all. Uh, let's see <laughs> if that's all. It's a look like it's all. Uh, hold to skip. Yeah, hold to skip. Uh, right, a couple of words uh, about the game itself. A usual stuff. Usual stuff. So welcome everyone. Our Sarah's here. Uh, we just finished uh, classified France forty four. Uh, a new tactical game from a team 17. Uh, we spent uh, 33 hours to complete the game. We played on elite difficulty. I really did enjoy every single map, uh, every single uh, scenario on this map, uh, on this game. In this game, uh, it really was well balanced. Uh, I did play it as much as I was expecting to play. And honestly, I got way more than I was expected actually from this game. Uh, it's really good. It's really good. My initial thoughts uh, on the game was uh, it's 9 out of 10. Uh, absolutely. Uh, the question I have to, 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 the, to the style with uh, uh, the graphic style uh, as well. You know, like, it, it, is, it, it is good. Uh, it is good, like many people like it, uh, especially in all the generation as me. Uh, but it could be like way better. Like the the whole art style itself could be uh, as good as like uh, Jagged Alliance 3. And uh, that's like minus point. Uh, all of this, like you know, fell a little bit, a little bit uh, as was breaking Im uh, immersion in, into the game. Uh, the constricted uh, old school. Uh, art style here. Uh, all right, th that's the only problem I had uh, when we're talking about tactical uh, gameplay, uh, strategic gameplay, because there is uh, some strategy to work around here. Uh, we have a global map, and we need to uh, think how we moving our pieces on the global map. What to do? There's a lot of preset uh, phase before the actual tactical mission. Uh, I love I love both part of this tactical combat itself uh, looking very good. So mind you, I, I I saw some someone complaining about like the enemy getting strong, you getting strong a little bit, but uh, enemy getting way stronger than you, uh, and uh, hard to kill them and stuff. I I heard I heard this complaint about people saying, honestly. We here are not to kill enemies, like we are resistance. We kill some, the good. We here to do objectives like sabotage, uh, eliminate specific target, and get out to fight another day. Uh, and the uh, game approach it like very seriously. The game developers approach this topic very seriously. Uh, with the, the tactical uh, fight uh, itself, so, uh, the enemy has two bars the health bar. Which is protected, uh, especially later game with a lot of uh, a, a lot of armor. And there's another bar, morale bar, the blue bar. So uh, shoot an enemy, even if you miss, even if you miss, can do damage to morale. It's guaranteed dealing to damage to the morale. And when the blue bar uh, drop into zero, the enemy just keeping his turn. So most of the fight. Instead of killing enemies, especially heavy and uh, armored enemies, I have my machine gunner or uh, any other guy who's gonna deal uh, a high morale damage, staying there, shooting them, uh, doing that morale damage and suppressing them and uh, making them uh, skip in the turn, right? When uh, other part of my team doing uh, some, some objective and prepare to ask, extract after that. Uh, I really like uh, what the developers done with uh, Overwatch here, uh, which is you, you have a chance to like, not not a chance to have you have ability uh, to select your target uh, who you shoot in the Overwatch, right? Uh, in a games like XCOM, 
the Overwatch uh, basically always shooting the, the first target who come uh, on the Overwatch. Uh, instead of like killing some important uh, minion, you're just shooting some, uh, well, not important, less important guy. And it's like, oh my god, if I, if I only shoot that guy, uh, I always had, had, had this Swords playing uh, XCOM. Uh, so that's a big plus for the classified uh, Friends 44. That uh, they make you, uh, they giving you ch a chance to like, is it not even shooting Overwatch? You put an uh, enemy in Overwatch, you realizing, well, this this, this is gonna be a uh, low chance to that uh, shoot that Overwatch, or uh, you realize that you don't want to uh, shoot at all uh, because it's still like uh, in a stealth mission, in stealth combat, and uh, you just can either pass the Overwatch or pass on the target that come in there. And just to shoot another target that came in after the, uh, after the your intended target, uh, all right. So that was a good decision. Another decision, uh, another, another gameplay moment. It's a stealth combat. There are a lot of missions here is based on ambush and uh, overall stealth combat. This is something the tactical stealth combat. There's something that we didn't have in Jagged Alliance, and I really, really did want to have in Jagged Alliance 3. The stealth combat, the classified friends done it perfectly. This is how how a stealth combat in tactical game should look like. Uh, there is a noise radius, uh, there is, uh, you can, you can kill, like, a uh, whole map in stealth combat. Uh, well, there, there, there is, there is one, uh, couple of maps that you m maybe could, but there's some, uh, guys immune to stealth damage, so you just basically can kill everyone, every single minion in the combat. But uh, overall, uh, most, uh, uh, most maps, like, there is three categories of, um, of maps. Stealth map when you kill most uh, everyone in stealth as long as you stay in stealth. Uh, ambush maps when you uh, can kill limited amount of people in stealth as long as you uh, keeping yourself hidden and uh, minding you know, the noise radius when you kill in some one someone. And there's ambush maps when you uh, don't have a stealth at all. all right, so uh, this guy's three type of missions uh, the game had. And uh, the developers just nailed the stealth combat here. I really did enjoy myself like doing the stealth missions. Like planning, repositioning uh, your team before the ambush, right? Uh, to attack the enemy from your flanks, uh, to suppress an enemy or breaking their morale and doing your objective. Because if you ambush, you have a free turn. Uh, so I really did, and like I say, enjoy that. And another thing, and another thing uh, to mention here is uh, the balance, overall balance and the difficulty of the game. We played on elite difficulty, and uh, despite me like Boston easy, uh, no challenge at all, like I usually <laughs> like to do, but uh, most of the map were actually were, were challenging and uh, require some some thinking, some planning for a couple of turns ahead. Uh, that was really, really good. Well done. I did have a problem with uh, some game bugs, which just uh, re make me reduce the, the score for the uh, for the game itself for uh, from nine out of ten to eight out of ten. It's still good, but uh, there was uh, some, especially at the at the end of the our campaign. Uh, we had uh, we jumped our D-Day um, counter from seven days to two days while doing the mission that uh, gonna cost that should cost me only two days there. So uh, basically, I just miss uh, uh, getting the counter closer to the D-Day, meaning you're you just missing on a couple of the missions you can do and then join, and they just well they they just never never came there. There are some choices to make in the game, some companions to to take instead. Uh, if you even like to say one companion, you, you basically have a team of eight uh, of your assistants. So you have like four companions to save, uh, but you will not be able to, to, to play another four. So the game uh, have a replayability, 
right? Depending on what insurance you can uh, take, what kind of, kind of companions you, you take on uh, your current campaign. You can go with a different uh, character's next campaign. So there is the replayability there. Uh, obviously, like uh, doing a different missions. Some missions you can do. Uh, you can do one mission, but uh, that means like another mission will be not available for you to do. There's also those choices to make uh, during the campaign. And uh, there's the factions, uh, reputations, uh, with the factions, three factions, the presence of the mission uh, in, in, the, in the game. I was able to uh, reach reputation 8 with all the factions, but it cost me like... Uh, uh, I've done it like, uh, close to the very end of the game, to basically the last mission. Uh, that, that's when you uh, get the reputation for all factions, which is the factions selling you uh, some unique gear, uh, which can increase your chances to successfully complete the missions. Uh, well, uh, what else? What else to say? So basically, I'm really, really did enjoy the game. People saying it was short. It does feel it's like a uh, shorter compared to XCOM campaign, both of XCOM campaign compared to Jagged Alliance 3 campaign. Uh, we like I say, say spent 33 hours here, uh, 33 hours uh, and a little bit bit a little bit more. And I'm generally playing the game uh, slower, and we're playing uh, all of those uh, stealth missions. We played very slow, uh, so people were claiming 20 hours campaign. And now I do believe them, 20 hours campaign, it does feel short, it does feel short. Do want to see more, but there's like uh, that, uh, the mission creator here, there's a special ops mission here, um, created by the game devs. Uh, if you if you felt like you didn't get much from, from the main campaign, there's still more mission to go and get this like, you know, just resting, get getting out, for, uh, getting getting from a job in the evening, getting uh, jump into one mission, and that's like what what I see. What, what we're gonna do is just tactical missions, tactical campaigns. Uh, so the the game is uh, really, 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 really great in that part of like you can enjoy a couple of missions uh, with uh, the cold beer. If you enjoy in the beer that hell after the work and that's done and you're not pressing uh, the game not pressing you to, to do like everything in one go uh, so yeah anyway my final verdict is a uh, 8 out of 10 I did forgot uh, to say to mention so some stuff uh, about the game that I really wanted to but that's how my memory won't uh, work I'm very forgetful uh, sometimes Especially like we haven't uh, much of sleep today uh, I, because I'm living in Ukraine. There was uh, the whole night we have air alarm here. Uh, but yeah, eight out of ten. That's the how I will rate this game. I have very good experience playing it, and I'm probably gonna be replaying it uh, after um, some points when they fix the bugs. Uh, mm -hmm. When they fix some bugs, there's not many bugs to, to find in this game, but the one that uh, just jumped my timer uh, to D-Day abruptly for no reason, uh, that was a major thing, because we can use this timer again to play a couple of more missions and join the game a little bit longer. Anyway, that's been Austerius. Uh, thank you very much uh, for joining me today, guys. Thank you uh, for JC Kiwi, JC Kiwi, uh, for providing uh, the gift card for which we uh, use uh, to buy the game and supporting the community, supporting the stream in that way. Really do appreciate it. I really do appreciate all the community, uh, all the guys, who, who, all all of you guys who who watching, all of you guys who uh, helped me uh, get in, uh, the games. Uh, all right. Thank you everyone uh, for that. And take care of yourself, stay safe, whatever you're doing, have fun with it. See you next time with something different.